So they decided they decided to break into Cyberdyne Systems and T101 Arnold breaks down the door. Wait, you can't go in there. Fire set off the Halon system. You have to wait a few minutes until the gas clears. What's up? The Halon system releasing toxic gas to humans, or at least gas that might knock you out. Is that a good fire suppressant system for a lab with people in it? <laughs> uh, I mean, yet another reason to why you should have robots, because they would not be bothered by the Halon system. Why, why did they die? Oh, they, did, they died from the fire, but only because they were knocked out by the Halon system. Like, what, what are we doing? That's right. Yeah, yeah. And two <laughs> two gas masks, yeah, it's great. Two gas masks, but more than two people work here. That's right. Plus you have to open up the gas mask container and distribute them somehow and they're all over the place. Like, so, so let me so, so let, me, let me tell you how this works, this plays out. <laughs> Somebody just causes a fire, they try to get with a fire extinguisher, it doesn't work, the fire's too big. The Halon system activates. Everyone does a free for all battle royale for these two masks in the room. <laughs> well, I guess these two masks, there must be mask stations scattered around. Okay, maybe, right? yeah. And so maybe. it's a free for all. Everybody, so people congregate at one station with two gas okay. masks, and others are, have not, nobody. And the okay. desk you're at, you have to run to the one that's closest to you. Like, what? So the Halon system activates, everyone gets up, and it's immediately musical chairs, but for gas masks. For gas masks. <laughs> They're like, there's two here, but there's three people. And they're like fighting, he's running around in a circle. And if you lose the musical chair, musical masks game, you die you by die. smoke inhalation or by fire. Yeah. What is what is a halon? Oh. Is the, I, I thought it was just some type of fire suppressant. Can and we can we look it up? I'll look it up. Oh, good idea. Yeah. Fire yeah. suppression. It's a, is it talking? a real thing? Oh, why is halon banned? Twenty twenty. Oh, okay, cool. There's no, no, uh, is Halon banned in fire suppression? No, there is no requirement to replace your Halon fire suppression system. In the mid-90s, the manufacturing of Halon was banned because of the environmental effects of the gas. However, the use of Halon was not banned. banned. So oh. so you can still have it, but you can't make new ones. Can't make new ones. So what Here is go. Here, this is what he wanted. What is Halon fire suppression? Halon is a liquefied compressed gas that extinguishes fire by reacting with the fire's elements, which is oxygen and carbon dioxide, okay, and breaks the chemical chain reaction. A fire needs three elements to sustain, oxygen, heat, and fuel. When you disrupt or remove an element, the fire cannot sustain itself. So what is Halon? So what is Halon? What? Uh, I guess we can just... What is Halon? Yeah. Halon 1301, bromotrifluoromethane, is usually found in fixed, in fixed extinguisher systems. Halon is a colorless, odorless gas with a density of approximately five tons a year. Okay. It is non-corrosive, uh, non-reactive with water, and stable up to 900 degrees Fahrenheit, 482 degrees C. Okay. So I guess it, what, is it toxic to humans? Or what's the word for a gas that kills people? Or does it just displace the air in the room and suffocate people? Is Halon dangerous to humans? Halon is a fire suppression agent that can displace oxygen and potentially cause suffocation if inhaled in high concentrations. Okay. Inhaling Halon can lead to dizziness, nausea, unconsciousness, which could be life-threatening if not addressed properly. Yeah, because you're like in a fire. Mm -hmm. So I guess it's not like chemically reactive. It's not, mm -hmm. um, oh, what's the word for this? It's not reactive. Mm -hmm. It's not biologically reactive. Okay. It's just, it can push all the oxygen out and then if you're breathing that in, you're going to suffocate. Mm -hmm. But it sounds like it also does cause some stuff some dizziness nausea unconsciousness but it sounds like you can be in the room with halon right it's going to be okay as long as you it's need to get out of there enough. quickly yeah 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 so then those masks are if people are going to stick around and like fight mm -hmm. the fire you put on the mask so they potentially could have entered the room to get yeah. their own masks okay it's not like they would just walk into a room and just drop dead Ooh, that's scary but yeah, I think that's right. Yeah, and I guess um, Terminator could blow out a window to help some airflow. Maybe that's good. true. That's true. Hmm, did I learn Halon system? Halon. 